This character, Y'all Grenades, I made it maybe a week ago and I leveled up. I, I got boosted, which is really, really nice. I, you know, I did some of my own leveling, but I also got boosted. But when I hit max level, one, basically one thing I tried to do as I leveled up was hit Winter Grasp and a little bit of like Ultrac Valley when I could and do like the BG daily, just so I had some honor when I got max level. But I want to show you the gear that I've been able to get. It is my slash played. I currently have seven hours played at max level and most of this gear I got within 10 minutes of being max level. Okay, so basically most of this I just bought off the auction house or all of it I did. Uh, the Frost Savage Cowl. So I got the full Frost Savage set, which is basically, it's slightly worse than the Savage gear, uh, but you can basically buy a full set of PVP gear right away. It has spell power, resilience, crit. I've showed you guys this before. You can buy a PVP cloak from the auction house. Um, you can buy boots, uh, every, everything. Uh, and because I'm a human, I had a ring, ruined banner band. Um, I bought my Bist Trinkets. So Dark Moon Card Berserker, Dark Moon Card Death. I bought this weapon for 1,000 gold, Titan Steel Spellblade. Now, I originally thought that I would have to get into like Naxxramas 10 to get a weapon, but this was just on the auction house, which owns. Uh, same with this offhand. And then I just bought this uh, Brutal Gladiators Piercing Touch for like 4,000 honor, 5,000 honor. So I could have a little bit of spell pen, but yeah, I fully enchanted all my gear and my stats are actually really good. Like I have over 600 resilience. I have decent spell power. I have good crit um, and I'm basically like arena ready. Now, obviously it's not ideal. My gear could be better, but with this gear that I got in like, I don't know, 10 minutes on the auction house, I can queue arena like right away. I can queue arena and I could definitely queue battleground. So I've just been Spamming Battlegrounds, slowly upgrading my gear. So I got the Deadly Neck, I got the Deadly Belt, um, I bought the Deadly Ring, I'm gonna buy the Deadly Boots, and then the Bracers, and then the Cloak, and then I'll start working on my set bonuses, and hopefully I get Lucky and Vault and stuff like that. And yeah, in maybe like a week or two, I'll basically have uh, comparable gear to my main. And a lot of, I, I noticed some people saying that like, oh, that's not realistic for a normal person to just buy stuff from the auction house. You're not going to have any gold, but it's actually not true. As you level, if you're like vendoring the greens and doing quests and stuff like that, you actually do make <clears throat> a couple thousand gold. So you can get most of this stuff pretty quick. So like gearing, uh, gearing alts and uh, getting ready for PvP is it's pretty reasonable, I'd say. On two. Oh, yes. Yay. Yes. All right, so we ding level 80 on my uh, my alt mage, all thanks to Korn, who literally just carried my leveling completely. Completely and utterly just absolutely carried me. Now it's time to go get fully geared. Now it's time to go shopping. Let's see how much gold we could spend. Now let's spend 400 gold on skills. Ugh. Aw, thank you. That's so nice. Trade canceled. Rip baited. Thank you, bro. All right, let's go buy some gear. Let's go buy. All right, watch this. This is actually, we're going shopping for everything. Watch this, okay? Thank you so much, man. All right, here, here's what we're doing. Watch this. Ruined mana. Ruined mana band. All right, 38 gold. So these are my stats before. Okay, these are my stats before. I'm gonna take a screenshot of this. This is gonna be funny. I'm literally gonna go eBay a full set of gear. Let's see how, let's see how fast. Let's see how fast I can gear my alt. So, ruined mana band. Purchase number one. Okay, now, what is the cloth set called? What's the PP set? It's called Frost Savage. Okay, we got a helmet. Is there a PvP cloak by any chance? Shoulders, chest, waist, feet, wrist, hands. Whoa, why are these so expensive? 410? That seems like a ripoff. Everything else was so cheap. Why is that? Should I just buy the hands? Cloak of Crimson Snow. Cloak of Crim. There actually is a PvP cloak. What? You can... Uh, I could buy my both my best trinkets too, which is kind of hilarious to me. Dark Moon. Well, these are expensive now, bro. What? Fine, those are like my best trinkets. Berserker was 300 gold. And now that everyone's playing fire, the price went up. I'm at 542 resilience already. In two seconds. Be super cheap if you need a wand. Gwenis Ruined Dragon Wand. All right, I'll get that. It's not that much of this. I'll use this for now. All right, now I go buy some deadly gear, right? Do I need rating to buy deadly gear? I think I do. You can buy a good chunk of it with no rating. I'm going to buy a ring and a neck, so I'm going to delete this. 
Elite. What gloves you needed? I needed the Frost Savage gloves is what they're called. Crit. Boom. Resilient spell power crit and then... Wait, you can buy this? Hit crit spell power? Wait, I'm 100% buying that. If I can buy that, I'm buying it instantly. What? Spell power hit resilience. Someone said it's only 1,000 gold on a Feralina. What about an offhand? Yeah, I don't know what I'm going to do about an offhand just yet, but... I think the next thing I should buy... I could buy the Hateful Ring, too. You think it's worth buying the Hateful Ring? It's not that much better than this one. I don't think I do buy it. Because I think the Ruin Mana Band... Uh, I think I just save. I think we save. Ruin Mana Band is very good. It's like, yeah, the Ruin Mana Band is fine. Look at this, guys! I'm already full bis. Why would I not buy this? I'm instantly buying this. It's fucking OP. This is better than, like, Nax 10 weapons. What? I'm not even gonna do Nax 10. I don't need to. Dude, this game is amazing. This this is... Wait. This wand is 13 gold? Wait, you can buy this too? Iron Bound Tome? Iron... Iron Bound. How much is this? It's only 200 gold? What? This... What? What is this gear I can buy? What the fuck? I'm full bis. I just eBayed full gear, man. I have full, I'm full bis. I'm actually confused why the gear is so good. You can just buy on the auction house. Like, look at this. I'm actually stacked. This guy made me gloves too. Thank you, man. You made me gloves. I really appreciate that. Thank you, dude. Like, look at this. I don't even have a chance. Wait, I'm actually so excited. What? I can pl I can play. Like, bro, I I don't have a chance. Look at this. I only have, I have 1,700 spell power in my main and 1,200 already with no enchants. What? How is this real? Let me let me put enchants on. I'm actually gonna dude. I'm gonna send this. Look at this. Fuck okay, it, bro. Sending the helm enchant. That's why I like wrath. I I literally am blown away. Yeah. So in 23 minutes. In 23 minutes of shopping on the auction house, I didn't even spend that much gold. I spent like 3,000 gold. I got all Frost Savage gear, fully enchanted. Well, the full the, the shoulder and helm enchant are from my, my main, to be fair. I had some honor saves, so I got the Deadly Knack. I got the Cloak of Crimson Snow, which is a PvP cloak. I got this Titan Seal Spellblade with the enchant on it, which is insane. Uh, Ironbound Tomb, which is a lot of spell power. Very good. Brutal Gladiator's Piercing Touch. Still Frost Savage, Frost Savage, Frost Savage, the Rune Mana Band, this PvP ring I bought in the auction house, I bought the Deadly Ring, and two Dark Moon cards. And I like, I have 600 resilience, I got 1400 spell power, I got 28% crit already. Chillin' dude.